TJ, and welcome to today's edition of TJ TV News. My name is Johanna. And my name is Andrew. Today is Monday, November 18th. Attention on new and returning Writing Center tutors. Please come by the Writing Center in room 214 for tutor training this Wednesday, November 20th. TJ TV is beginning the series Humans of TJ. Here's a sneak peek of the second episode, Early Birds of TJ, the athletes who practice at 5 a.m. At 5 a.m., most Jefferson students are still lying in bed asleep in preparation for an exhaustive school day. However, Ria Goswami enters the ice ring in anticipation for a two-hour practice of ice dancing, embodying the commitment of a competitive athlete. This is early birds of TJ, the athletes who practice in the morning. The only time I can skate is during the morning, and oftentimes it's usually from 5 or 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. And I have to do that because I get home at 5 and sessions also end at 5, so that doesn't really work out. There are days I don't want to go skating in the morning, and sometimes I'll have like a big test the next day and I stayed up, I often don't go. But most of the time what keeps me going is that I have my sister, and to show her that you can keep skating and you can have so many other things in your life as well is a really big factor. And as well as instilling the lessons that I learned, like discipline, honesty, and just rigor. Waking up in the morning at 4 a.m. may sound horrific, and leaving your warm bed may sound atrocious. But if it's something that you love and something that you're passionate doing, you often that drives you to get out of bed. So that's what kept me motivated to skate and also get out of bed that early in the morning. That's what I hope to tell you all. Anthony Wong, like Rhea, is a student athlete who sacrifices sleep for his sport. Having begun competitive swimming since age 9, Anthony practices six times a week, including 4.30 to 6.30 in the mornings every weekday. I've been exposed to the water ever since I've been a child. My mom always tells me stories about how I'm super excited to go into the water and do different lessons. So something has basically just clicked with me, sort of how different subjects in school also clicked with me. It's not as much of a burden as it is a thought of it paying off in the end. So everything that I'm doing right now, yes, in this moment it's hard, but in the end I'll be able to see the results and be able to tell myself, oh, this was 100% worth it. For an extended version of Early Birds of TJ, visit the TJ Today YouTube channel for more. Please take a moment to restart your FCPS on laptop now. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel. For TJ TV News, this is Andrew Arnold and Johanna Lomas. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again next week.